The Real Opinion is brought to you by Rainstorm Car Wash. Get in and get clean today. All right, now it's time to check in with the man who has the real opinion, Mr. Gino Reynolds. And we're talking about the call this morning with uh, Halle Berry. Right, the second of uh, two WWE-produced films okay. uh, in two weeks. And I got to say, I really like this one, just like Dead Man Down. I think WWE has finally figured out the formula of how to get their, their superstars into movies without force-feeding them in leading roles. Mm -hmm. uh, David Otunga is a uh, he's kind of a one of the not more well-known wrestlers he plays a minor part in this and mm -hmm. and then they surround him by some decent actors so okay. you know it's kind of nice that they aren't force feeding us their you know their b-level talent and trying to call them right, you know the actors, actors. Okay, and yeah. it's a good way to start and i think they finally found the formula and it works really well okay, this is actually so a really good thriller I was going to say, I'm, I'm very, uh, I haven't really heard a lot about this, so, so set it up for us. Well, what it is is Halle Berry's character is a 911 caller operator, okay. and she makes a mistake that actually someone dies. And then six months later, uh, she's off the phones, they make mm -hmm. her a teacher, and then a rookie can't handle a call of an abduction, and she takes over, and it, it may or may not be the same guy that killed, really? the, killed okay. the girl six months earlier. Yeah, okay, very interesting. That does sound thrilling. <laughs> right. There's uh, actually two standout performances in this. Halle Berry's decent. I, I think he could have really had anyone in that role. It wasn't that special. Mm -hmm. uh, Abigail Breslin, who is best known for uh, the little girl in uh, Little Miss Sunshine. Oh, right, okay. She is the victim, the kidnapped victim. And she spends most of the movie in the trunk of a car or tied up. Oh, no. And she plays the victim very well, and she's learning to get stronger and how mm -hmm. to survive this. And she does a really good job. And Michael Eklund, who is the villain mm -hmm. in this, uh, he's one of the creepiest villains I've seen since Buffalo Bill. And, oh, my gosh. And, uh, okay. Sansa wow. Lambs. And he just, just the way he acts, he's, he's always sweating and breathing mm -hmm. funny and saying strange things. Yeah. And, and he doesn't know how to handle when he gets confronted by someone in public and it's just really creepy. Right, and so. I will never uh, think of the song uh, Karma Chameleon by Culture Club the same way ever again. I'll just leave it at okay, that. Okay, wow, definitely a lot to think about there. Okay, and uh, a last bit, we have uh, the Opies are up. Yes, the Opies went up online last week. Go to YouTube channel, search The Real Opinion. They're near the top of the page. Okay. Let me know what you think about my picks. All right, sounds good. Thanks a lot, Thank Gino, you. and we'll be right back. The Real Opinion is brought to you by Rainstorm Car Wash. Get in and get clean today.